Hey guys, this is Rolf. We just pulled a few Antminer S7s out of production and we're going to get, go ahead and clean them up before we uh, get them ready for shipping to folks that are buying them used. So here we go, we got an Antminer S7. I've got my uh, air compressor and compressed air screwdriver to take it apart. If you look here a little bit more closely, you'll see it's a little bit uh, yellow. That's from the pollen and some of the dust. We had a very dusty uh, spring. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, blow off the outside first and then I'll open it up and clean off the interior board. So let's go ahead and do that. I saw some of the uh, dust from the outside came out. Alright, so we're going to take out the hashing cards. We don't need to take the fan off the outside, we just kind of take the whole end assembly off. And you think you can just blow it through, but what I found is it's really better to take it apart. So we've got our hashing boards in here. This is what they look like. And you can see that we've got some dust really at the front end. And we don't want that dust building up and overheating things because that's the way that you burn out the individual processors. So this also gives us the opportunity to take pictures of the serial numbers uh, before we send these out. So real simple. Well, that was the air compressor, so we'll uh, use a lot of compressed air in this. And as you can see, it's really important to blow out all the dust. We do that every few months here, depending on how dusty the conditions have been. Okay, so we reattach the fans. Now we're going to go take it over to the initial setup. That's how you clean out the Antminer S7 and get it ready for shipping. Thanks.